Hi, I'm Vic, and welcome to Geeko Farm, where I really wish I was doing something differently. Mucking out the, uh, the chicken, no, you don't need to see that. Mucking out the uh, chicken coop is my least favourite job, um, and it seems to be causing a certain amount of consternation amongst the flock. Winter has arrived, so uh, we're going to give them a choice of bedding. They can have a good layer of sawdust, and they can fiddle around with as much hay and straw as they want to to build their nests and keep themselves warm and snug during the cold nights. By burying all the uh, chicken bedding under the garden, we, we uh, form something that's well draining and will uh, not drown our crops when the rain comes down. I'm sweeping out the nest boxes and uh, then I'll put in some of this diametaceous earth which kills all the little mites. Yeah. While cleaning out, I couldn't help but notice that these two, exhibit A and B over there, are not the young pullets that we were sold, but are in fact roosters. This does not bode well for them. Oh look. Cock over. Mmm, mushrooms too. Lovely. <sighs> and here's one for Catherine. Uh, that shed out there I was uh, cleaning it up to get some of the hay out and I found a tiff egg. Uh, for those of you who don't know tiff, uh, she passed away about two years ago, so uh, high time for this egg to enter politics, I think. A request has flooded in for details on how to make that sort of sparky cutty logo thing we did on the last episode. So here's what you'll need. Aluminium foil, fairly obviously. And a tape gun. A cardboard box or other suitable frame. A car battery of some kind, this is a jump starter. If you're just using a car battery, you'll need leads and clips and things. And a small galvanized nail. And the galvanized nails give a nice rough sparky effect at the edges. So you take the aluminium foil and you fold the edge over several times. Uh, this gives you a nice robust thing to clip your uh, power cables to. Then you put the aluminium foil in the frame and take it firmly down at the edges. It's important that the file is taut, otherwise you have difficulty making contact to make the arc. Then you write in reverse on the back of the foil the thing that you wish to cut out. This makes it easier to do. And uh, then you hook one terminal of the battery, it doesn't really matter which one, to the big wad of aluminium foil you've left hanging off the end. And you clip the galvanized nail into the other uh, terminal of the battery. Here you can see I've just crimped the head of the nail in a 22 bullet case just to make it easier for the great big cock crocodile jaws to grab hold of. And then you can poke the foil with the nail and it will cut in the most amusing way. The brassica beds are looking good. We've got a few tiny little cauliflowers forming already. Um, and oh, uh, would you like to see more gardening stuff on the video? Or would you like to see sort of cooking stuff or, or me blowing stuff up? Um, let me know in the comments below. And uh, if you aren't already, please subscribe. We were hoping to bring you news of the olive harvest in this episode, but unfortunately it's a wee bit damp to harvest olives. So for now, from me and Kanye, that's your lot down on Geeko Farm.